Luke discovers he's made a big mistake. And the more experienced Robert is quick to remind him. It's actually, huh? this is a very bad thing not to close your boma. That's it's, in like, it's, in, it's welcoming any troubles. That's like, yeah, mistake number one. <laughs> yeah, no, this is the one, a big mistake in the bush, not to close your boma. By not shutting the door to their shelter, anyone or anything could have come in. Quite easily get raided by monkeys, baboons, even hyena will raid you. Small rodents. Small rodents, rats. Anything that can find its way in here will take our food and Yeah, but with this, uh, um, porcupines is terrible. Mm. So what are we going to do tomorrow, Luke? We're definitely going to close the boma. That's right. <laughs> they spend time in camp tending to their injuries so they can continue chasing down the poachers tomorrow. Oh, nice bit of cotton wool. All that gunk out. Robert has to treat a painful blister. And I'm just going to make a small little incision slash hole in there, just like that. Jiggle it around a little bit. Right. Plus some pressure. Not really working. Another little hole. More pressure. All it is is inflated skin, really. Check. If left untreated out here in the bush, Small injuries like this can have serious consequences. Time at camp is also a good opportunity for a real meal. They will need as much energy as they can to catch up with the poachers. For Luke, lighting the fire is a chance to practice some ancient bushcraft. Wait. Come on, man. please. Yeah. Will it work? <laughs> As Luke gets increasingly frustrated, Robert, the team leader, can't resist teasing the rookie. Oh, yeah, no, I'm loving this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Luke won't give up Come and on. tries another technique. You know, I can see this way working better than the bow, huh? Except I'm <laughs> Come on, Luke, blow it, blow it. Light my fire, baby. Get more tinder, Robbie, quick. Finally, Robbie, you got fire. <laughs> the first cup of coffee is just going to be so good. <laughs> yeah, just tomorrow, we'll just hit that fence patrol first. All right. Do a bit of a sweep and that sort of a thing. They are playing catch up with the poachers so they don't know when they will be eating next. Yeah, I reckon this, okay, is, no, this is This is sorted, yeah, cool. Like, and the rice is done also. And the rice is done. The following morning, and with time running out, Robert gets a rare call from headquarters about the sighting of a poacher's dog. It seems they are closing in on their targets. The modern world is calling. Robert, hello. Last night, a poacher's dog was spotted nearby. Poachers often use the dog's sense of smell to warn them of danger. Robert and Luke need to follow up this lead quickly. They pack up, ready to set an ambush on the fence line where the dogs and poacher were last spotted. This time, remembering to close the Boma door.